Hey Challengers, Coach Ashley here and I wanted to check in with you today and um, tell you how excited I am to have all of you here. Today's day one of the challenge and I want to go over a couple things, but the very most important thing is I want to tell you what the winner of this challenge is going to receive. Drum roll please. We've got the option, so you get to choose one of these programs, Brazil Butt Lift. I know, I know, you probably don't know much about this one, but it's one of my favorites. <laughs> Brazil Butt Lift. We've got Payo. Look at that, still in the wrapper. Mint condition, ooh la la. This is a great program. Um, a little bit about the Brazil Butt Lift. It is one of the hardest um, leg and butt workouts I've ever done. It has a bunch of DVDs in it. Um, it's got a full schedule for 30 days. It has a great strength program in there. It's really, really good program. Um, Pio is a 60 day program and it is all about strength and flexibility and it is such a wonderful, wonderful program. I can't tell you m more great things about it. It's, um, let me think. It's, it also uses the um, a very similar nutritional guide as the um, container system for 21 day fix. Very, very, very similar, almost identical. Um, that's an extra DVD for Pio. And we've got 21 Day Fix Extreme. Yes, if you're doing 21 Day Fix now, you can take this right after 21 Day Fix, get right into Extreme, and continue your progress. This is an awesome program. Um, or you can choose to have the Fix 8 Cookbook. This has over 101 21 Day Fix recipes in it. It's awesome and it really helps with your meal planning. Great recipe book. Okay, so you get an option of one of these awesome prizes. The winner of this challenge is going to walk away a very happy person. Okay, so those are your choices for the winnings. Let me tell you how you could win, how you can win. So every day you have an opportunity to win points. There's daily points, which you get one point each for a picture of your Shakeology and a picture of your sweat pic, like messy, gross face, right after you're done working out, don't shower, get your phone, snap a picture, and you're gonna post it to this group. Your picture of your sweat pic and your picture of your Shakeology, both one point each. So right there's two points that you can earn for the day. Um, you have an option of bonus points, um, it's probably going to be a couple times a week, so you have to check in every single day to see if there are bonus points for that day. You're not going to want to miss them because they're usually about five points each, sometimes ten, so you're going to want to make sure that you check in every day and make sure you get those points. Um, we're going to track our points on a tracking sheet on Google um, Sheets, which is a Google Drive. and it, once you put points or whatever you type in there, it saves automatically so you don't have to click save and everybody can see it and everybody can add their points, okay? So you gotta keep up with that. You gotta keep up with tra tracking your points so we can all know where, we're, where we are, okay? I'm gonna remind you continuously, you've gotta track your points, okay? Um, you're also gonna wanna track your food. Now, I'm just speaking from experience here and not just my experience, but the over 100 people who've done challenges with me experience that if you make a meal plan every week, which you should be doing, you have your meal plan, you go grocery shopping, you have your food at home. That doesn't mean you're going to stick to your meal plan just by making it. And what I suggest is that, highly suggest, is that you make this in priority to you to track your food. So I posted earlier today a video about my favorite apps that track your food, um, container tracking apps. You got to do it. The, uh, like you have to do it. It keeps you accountable. This whole thing is about accountability. If we want to change something about ourselves, it's so much easier when you're holding yourself accountable and making yourself do things that you wouldn't normally do. And one of them is track your food. And the reason why that's so important is because you're going to find patterns you're going to know when you're hungry. You're going to, you're going to think twice before you eat something. You, you just write it down, okay? So track your food. Um, some of those bonus days might be to post what your food tracker says for the day. 
So make sure you're tracking your food. Um, okay, so the more we participate, all of us, the better off we're going to be. Um, and we're not just doing it for us. This is a group, and we're here for group support. So even if you normally wouldn't have a hard time staying accountable, do it for everybody else in the group. Check in every day. Post your sweat pic, because your sweat pic isn't just there for you. It's there for everybody else. There are many, many times where we have um, didn't get our workout in in the morning. For example, I work out in the morning. If I don't work out in the morning, it is so, so hard for me to work out at night. I mean, ridiculously hard. Almost impossible. But when I'm in a challenge group and I see everybody else posting and those who are posting at night, posting their workouts, it gives me the motivation and really just the like, well, who am I not to work out if everybody else is working out kind of attitude. So your posts are going to help you, but they're also going to help everybody else in this group. So we are here for each other. I want to see everybody participating. Um, a little, um, oh, another thing, it's more fun. It's more fun in these groups when you participate every day. And I mean, that's the whole point of this, right? We want to have fun while we're reaching our goals or else we wouldn't be doing this. So do it. Post every day. Okay. Check in every day. Like everybody else's stuff. Have fun with this. Okay. And some of our challenges are going to be a ton of fun. And some of them are going to be a ton of like quirky, silly things. Just do it. Okay. Um, <laughs> it's going to make you a better person because you're going to uh, reach outside of your comfort zone. You're going to be working towards something that you haven't before. And I'm telling you, it's going to make you a better person. When we reach outside of our comfort zone, we become better version of ourselves. Okay, so lastly, I just want to do a little housekeeping. When we post the daily posts in the morning, I want you to post your um, sweat pics and your Shakeology pics in the comments of that day's posts. This will make Facebook, um, the whole group, much more organized, and it'll keep that day's post up at the top so everybody else sees it. So let me repeat. We're going to post in the morning. And it's going to be like hashtag day one, right? And then you're going to put your picture, your sweat pic, and your Shakeology pic in the comment section of that post. Make sense? The only time that you can't do that is if it's a video. And that's fine. You can do it on, you know, just in the group. But if it's just a picture or a comment, put it under that post in the comment section. Okay, I hope that makes sense. Um, and then if we ever ask you to do a challenge, like a mini challenge, and you have to post anything on your timeline, I want you to make sure that you tag your coach with it so they can find it. It's got to be in the actual post, not in the comment section below. In the post, tag your coach. Okay, I think that's it. I'm really excited for you guys. I can't wait to see who's going to win one of these prizes. Look at all these awesome prizes. What, what? Somebody is going to go home with one of these. Is it going to be you? Is it? Is it? It might be. All right, I'm excited to get started. Let's go, let's do this. Um, I'll talk to you soon. Make sure you watch this. Make sure you comment below. Tell me you're on board and let's do this. All right.